Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well today. So we are going to do a little bit more work in our um, Patricia flippy thingy. And I have some stuff ready for us to put in it. Guys, she's already getting fat. So yeah, we're going to have to see how this goes. We might have to to cool it a little bit. So these are the pockets that we did in the last video. And all I did was went and sewed around them. So we are going to need to actually glue those two together. And then I made this. Let me get this off of there. Um, so this is just a piece of cheesecloth, some uh, burlap, and one of those pictures from uh, Taylor Made Journals. I believe it was. Wasn't that who we said, guys? Let me double check. I don't want to be wrong. Oh, I thought we had that on one of these. Yes, guys, Taylor made journals. Sorry about that. Um, so I just made this, and I did just sew around it. So we made this to go on there, and I'm thinking I will put it right in here on this. I thought that would be cute. And then we have, of course, this pocket, and this is going to go on here to make a pocket, two pockets here. So you have a pocket here and a pocket here. So we are going to, and there's some other stuff, but we will do that whenever we get to it. Hope you guys are all still doing well. It's actually still the um, same day as last time I videoed. <laughs> it is Thursday. So yeah, I thought I would, yep, I think we're going to do that. Just go ahead and get another video done and plus I was doing the sewing and working on this journal <coughs> really having a good time working on it so we are going to go ahead and get these two pieces glued together and then we will get them glued in our book or flippy thingy whatever we want to call it and I think she left these sides open guys so we're going to Go ahead and do that too and see how it goes. This is just going to lay right on the top of here, just like so. Get that squished down. I guess I should have got out a baby wipe. Let me go ahead and do that, guys. I think I have one hmm, somewhere. Oh, other side. There we go. Try to keep it. Throw it in the floor. Cleaned up a little bit. Alright. So we have that pocket. And we are going to glue it to here. We just have to decide exactly am I in frame guys I'm sorry I'm all over the place see if we want it like up farther so that we can see this down here and I believe that I do let's see I think I'm going to actually for mine I think I'm going to glue this down guys and I just pulled that all the way up so Yep, and I'm getting no glue out. Goodness. I'm having glue issues, guys. Go ahead and put some in there. then we will go ahead and get this glued down we still have to um, figure out of course what we want geez Lori in these pockets over here um, really don't need it to be anything too thick because 
like I said, she's becoming a fatty real, real quick. Let's see. There we go. I think that's it right there. Get some of that glue off my fingers. we got that down so now we have a pocket here and we have a pocket here yep all right and now we will get this nope I think I was gonna do this first guys this little piece here. I, I wanted to put that there. And then put that there. Yep, I think we're gonna do that. So we will just put just a little bit of glue here. So they're gonna take that much. Put that there. There we go. Then we will get some glue on here and get this popped in. We will have this complete. make sure that we can see this stitching over here on the edge oh that's cute guys look oh look at how cute oh I love it what do you guys think how cute is that yep that's really cute okay yay all right we got that now, what I did over here, guys, was, we're still not messing with that yet, so I just took another one of the pictures from Taylor Made Journal and took some of this muslin and then I put some pink dyed cheesecloth behind it and then just stitched this picture onto here. That's what I did with that. And then on this, I just took... A piece of this lace figure out which way it goes who knows it's a toss-up and I thought about putting it here I think I'm gonna need to maybe cut just a hair off Let's see if we can do it and get it somewhat straight Alright, let's try that. And let's go ahead and do just a tad off of this end. Again, trying to get it somewhat straight. Alright, let's see. This way. Jeez. Alright, so we want to put this here and then it's going to put this little piece here. Yep, and I think I had decided I needed to cut a little bit more off of that. Put this piece here and then we're going to put her about here. And then I have this little crochet dolly that I thought we could then put here. Okay, maybe we'll bring her down a little bit. There we go. How about that, guys? Is that cute? Yep, I think that's really cute. So, 
we will go ahead and do some gluing. I think what I'll do is get some glue on here and then just smooth it out with my fingers since we're pretty much putting that um, lace all over it. We'll see how that works. Try to get it out. Sometimes it's hard to get this glue out, or it is for me anyway. Okay. Maybe we'll just do this. Kind of spread that out and around. Alrighty. And then. which way she goes. Y'all, I have no clue. We're just going to put it down. Alright, there we go. Sure I don't have it over too far that way. Alright, there we go. Excuse me. Looks like we will snip just a teeny tad off there. See, I don't want to cut anything, guys. Let's see. There we go. Okay, I apologize if I get my fat head in the um, camera. That would not be pleasant for anyone. Okay, got that. Okay, which way does it go? This way. Alright, so we got that. And then next, let's go ahead and do this little piece down here. Well, all right, guys. I'm gonna use the uh, fabric tack because I don't feel like fighting with that <coughs> to get it to come out. My hands can't handle it right now. So we will get a little bit of glue on here. that piece there. Alrighty. And then we will figure out exactly where we want her and where we want this. Yep, I think that's good. Just like that. Alright, so we will get some glue on her. And I think I'm just going to actually go around where the um, stitching is. And then in the middle. And not like glue down the edges around it. If we can remember... out where yep that looks good about where we were gonna put her got glue bookers on my fingers guys all right and then now we can get some glue on here and get this down Then we could pull up these little edges if we need to to get some glue on that. Kind of wanted that on the picture just a little bit. And 
Here we go. Well, that is just super cute, guys. Look at there. Isn't that pretty? Yep, yep. I like it. Alright, so now we will just put just a little bitty spot on these. Glue. Okay, I think those are down. Well, that one's not too good. Get that on these. Make sure they don't come up when you're opening and closing it. There we go. That's working out pretty good. The um, my youngest daughter Veronica, her kids had scouts tonight and we have a old courthouse that they have been working on for years literally to um, remodel it they're kind of you know trying to keep some of the you know the antique furniture and different stuff like that and they have it all decorated for Christmas and it is so pretty she showed me pictures they got back and it's actually she found out is our new welcoming center which neither one of us knew so I guess perhaps we don't keep up with things like we should but yeah it's a new welcoming center so I think I may just drive over there one day and check it out it's really pretty old old courthouse right in the middle of town Ugh, at the glue, guys. Okay. Enough with that. Alright. Oh, that's so cute. Ugh, I love it. Wow. Okay. Alright, so now... Let's go ahead and move this aside. Let's get this pocket down. And I was looking at it, guys, and it looks like I may have to just trim a little bit off of this side so let me do that because it looks like it's kind of catching and hitting whenever we close it so I could just try to take off a tad here <coughs> and then we can just re-ink this side I think it'll still be okay because it didn't get into the stitching or anything Yep, I think that's going to do better. Gets us off of those edges too bad when we go to close it up. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and put this pocket down. We'll just go ahead and use this Fabri-Tac. Make sure I have it the right way. It would be me who would glue it upside down all right so let's get this in here and I want it just above so that we can still see that stitching there we go I think we did good Awesome. So we got a pocket back there now. It's really cute too. Love those butterflies. And then of course pink. Two of my favorite things. Alright. So guys. Alright. Are we going to go ahead and commit to this here? So I was thinking that there. And then 
this here. And just putting that on there. Hmm. Let's see, we need... Okay, perhaps not. Let's see. If we put this up here like that maybe that's cute I think that's cute but then what do we want to do here let's see I don't want another one of those I mean this thing's just getting too thick plus that's a weird one anyway um um, 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 um. Okay, we'll wait on that one because I'm not sure. I'm very, very undecided as far as that goes. Okay, so now we have a pocket here, guys. So we need to make something to go in there. And then this flips open. This goes... Big old fat fingers, I can't tie a little bow. Okay. Okay, I guess that's okay. It's looking a little crooked here. See that, guys? Oh well, it is what it is. Alright, so that's gonna go that way. Then we have this here. Then we have our journal. Okay, guys, I think we're going to take this out because it is getting so thick. And we can just make a journaling card for here. And then maybe put some pockets here. What if we did... No, I think we would want them going the other way. Instead of that way. Maybe going this way. Okay, maybe we could do that there. It's pretty. Maybe we'll leave that plain. Put some pockets here. Maybe put some trim at the bottom. Put some pockets here. Oh, guys, I also made this paper clip. Look at how cute. This is Paris. So all I did was took a little piece from this flap that we had cut off and made an ultra paper clip. And I just backed it with some coffee dyed paper. Um, and then the front of it, you really can't see it that much because I covered most of it up. But I just covered it with a piece of the, a page from the kit, a little scrap that we had. And then I just put a couple of layers of lace, then some coffee dyed cheesecloth, the word Paris. And this is one of, um, Claudia over at, um, Timeless Crochet for You, one of her little flowers that's got the, um, yeah, these little things on it. What are those called? So, I thought that would look cute there to hold that down. And then, of course, you take that off. You open it up. We will have a pocket here where we could put something. And then we just have some ephemera. And I think I will just go ahead and use these two pieces. I am going to rough up this edge a little bit. I did do that to the... Um, pictures as well before I um, distress those. Oops, there we go. And we'll just go ahead and distress around these two cards a little bit. Go ahead and get the back as well. So there's one. Oops. And then we'll get this one. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Guys, 
got the door closed because my husband's in there watching TV and now it's getting hot in here. Alright, so those can just go there. And then we pop that on there. That's really cute. Okay, so we have that. <coughs> and then... Alright guys, in the next video we're going to do this. Uh, my throat's actually getting really, really agitated. So I'm going to go ahead and call this a video. Thank you guys for coming along with me. Having a lot of fun and we'll see you next time. Bye.